Hi again. Guess who? It's me again. Right. Um. Just fun. I thought I'd do another little video for you. Um. Just. Uh, I've shown you this radio before in a comparison with another little Chinese radio. It was only about five quid, but it's just obviously uh, just medium wave, long, um, medium wave and FM. Um. But uh, I got it on the amateur bands. I don't know if you can see that. 14.20 it was quite strong quite strong uh... right <coughs> yes, a strong sideband station there um, anyway I made this little BFO again in a in a separate little box and it's just um, I'm injecting it into the back of the antenna aerial through a little lead and uh, I'll show you on the back it's just like a little um, little bar antenna thing so if I turn it on anyway Now you can hear the uh, resolve sideband. Uh, it's just from a little external BFO in the built in the box, and um, it come through quite clear there. I'll just turn that off a minute. And on the back, there you can see the little. Um, it's an external little bar antenna, well with a coil on it which I got with one of my radios um, it's just got a jack plug on there, on the end so what I've done is done an adapter to this phono plug and then that lead comes out of the, uh, out, out of the BFO I made which is built inside the box and it's got a 9 volt PP3 battery in there operating it and uh, then you can just uh, have sideband on a little uh, five pound radio really um, quite amazing anyway I thought I'd just show you that not a very good video I'm afraid it's a bit uh, awkward to do with one hand but anyway <clears throat> I'll uh, I'll catch you again I suppose soon with some another exciting video <laughs> so bye for now and this is G7ILP Kev saying goodbye